Yep, that's right, it's me again. Somebody sent me a message bitching about guns. Oh, God, you got to have more gun control. I am sick of doing videos about gun control. But I'm going to do this one because I call this video gun culture. That's right, ladies and gentlemen, gun culture. The United States lives on gun culture. It is in everything. No matter what you turn on TV, you're going to find guns. This whole country was founded on guns. And if you know what I mean, we're talking about, they're even in, they're in movies. Like Aliens. Woo! Rambo. Well, all about guns. Look at that. The bounty killer. See? Guns. Hell is for heroes. Guns. It's all about guns. The Fighting 69th. World War I flick. All about guns. You have them in movies. You have them in TV shows. You have them everywhere. And everybody's complaining about guns. Oh my God, guns! Well, guns, like I said, is in our culture. Why bitch about it? Why cry? Why make a big deal about it? People die every day of guns. It's in our video games, right? Like Mad Max. And Bloodborne. Woo! How about Resident Evil for the original PlayStations? It's got guns in it. How about Space Hulk? Space Hulk, PlayStation. Even the very favorite Cars video game has missile launchers, Gatling guns, um, bomb throwers. Dude, for kids, a game for kids that has guns in it. Right? It's in the culture. Fallout 4, all about guns. See if I'm right, see if I'm wrong. It's, it's everywhere. You people just seem to have this heart attack over guns. It's even in our comics. Comic books. See? Guns. It's even in our comic books. Guns. Look at that big explosion. Look at those machine guns. Guns. It's in our comics. You people don't get it. It's in toys. Even for kids. Like old Optimus Prime. And what is he holding? He's holding a gun with shitload of bullets loaded in the magazine. See that, Optimus Prime? See that? He's got guns. You can find these things at Toys R Us for kids. They got guns. Like G.I. Joes. G.I. Joes have guns. They have pistols. They have rifles, machine guns. Right? It's even in little kitty guns, like Star Wars stuff. Like this blaster from Star Wars. This is a eight-year-old kid's toy. Pew, 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 pew. Right? And they graduate to the bigger ones, huh? Look at that, huh? It's in our culture. Guns, guns, guns. It's everywhere. It's in books. DVDs. Porno. Dude. Even the lowly thermometer, digital thermometer, has a trigger on it. Like guns, even medical devices are in the shape of guns. So why is everybody making a big fit? Why are they so worried about gun control? More people die in car accidents in the United States than to cancer and than to guns. Believe it or not, Stabbings is way up there, too. You're not going to stop. You're not going to get rid of knives, right? Machetes, shovels, anything with a blade. You'll never get rid of guns. And that's why I'm talking to you, all you congressmen and senators and governors and mayors. You're not going to stop it. You're never going to stop it. This country was founded on guns. Every against the first founding. We fought in the Revolutionary War and won our independence from England using guns. Fought in the Old West, guns. Civil War, guns. Guns help get rid of slavery. Guns help get rid of fascism. Guns help get rid of Nazism. And in a lot of ways got rid of a lot of communism. 
So if you ask if what is guns has ever done for this country, there is your four examples. It got rid of slavery, fascism, Nazism, and communism in this country. It stops the criminals from doing incredible things, mass murder. Eventually they get gunned down or they shoot themselves with the gun. You will not stop it. So stop trying to control guns. Keep them in the hands of good law-abiding citizens to allow them to protect themselves, their property, and their families. So all you left-leaning, whining libtards, get it through your head. Guns are here to stay, and they'll always be here. This is Jeff DeFaro going, Huh.